Hey everyone, before we begin this episode of Everlasting Summer, I did this the last episode too, just doing a, a short test, you know, with these two episodes. Um, if you like this at all, subscribe, like, you know, if you want to see more of me. If you don't want to, that's fine, but I'm just kind of testing to see if this actually helps with subscriber gain. You know, it's good to test things. Because I'm a mad scientist, so, you know, you have to test things because science, like, you form a hypothesis saying, okay, okay, like, y you guys don't have science for this isn't even safe yet. <laughs> um, I thought I was playing Steinfgate. <laughs> um, well, <laughs> oops, surprise. Sometime later, I finally came to the infirmary. I have nothing to do in that place. Yeah, don't go in there. No, that nurse is creepy. So you're out of ten. So the nurse seems quite caring. It's best to keep distance from her. Such benelephants. Benelephants. It's actually scary. Benelephants. Is that like an elephant? She may know something, but I had no courage to just enter the infirmary. But moreover, I had no motive. Not a single one. Immersed in my own thought, I didn't notice the nurse, nurse who was standing at the porch. Hi there, pioneer. She came closer. You must be sick. Came for medicine? No, 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 I was just wandering around. Oh, the trunk. Trunk, I see. Those, those eyes. I Two, two different colors. Is she like, um, is it one of them like an evil eye that like, um, is like actually a contact the whole time, but it's like lets her see into the future and the, um, the event horizon or... I haven't watched Shunobo in ages. That one, Ko Koyani show. I watched it last spring, but you know, they kind of ruined it. Season 2. Don't watch season 2. But if you're here, I have a ser serious task for you. I gave her a look of inquiry. Why? The word task made me feel that easy. Suddenly like something inevitable. The nurse smiled spitefully. You both will help me, both? To make the inventory of the me supplied medicine which arrived today. Both. Who are we? Perhaps I misheard. But what word can be confused confused with both? Yes! Hi again. When I emerged from the nurse's back. It seems strange that I haven't noticed her until now. Come here after dinner. I have explained everything to Lena. She will tell you what to do. Medicine, huh? Supply today? But Olga had told me that no bus will arrive in the next couple of days. So there were no visitors in our camp today? I wonder if I've landed on the Lena route yet. Um, I wonder if it works kind of similar to Katawai Sojo, where after a certain point, you're locked in there out, or, you know, like, I wonder how it works. Or maybe there's like, um, I guess it's like the traditional. Is it traditional? I don't actually know. We'll just. Whoever you have the most points in by the end of the game, you get the. I don't know. So there are visitor visitors in our camp today? Yes, they arrived from the city this morning. Why are you asking? Just curious. Alright then, Pioneer! So tonight, after dinner, dinner, you will be here. No, I don't want to. Maybe I. That's, that's Lena voice for now on. Lena was barely noticeable this whole time. Surely. She was able to keep invisibility like a skilled ninja. I can do it on my own. No way, I gotta I gotta help. Lunar out points. No way, there are lots of boxes. And the pioneer is always ready. Isn't it so? Pioneer. I'm scared. I am scared. She's gonna like murder me. She's she's the Yandere a whole she's a Yandere the whole time. She guessed I mean smiled menacingly. I don't want to spend whole Whole eve I don't want to spend whole evening doing something like this. Also, I've got more important things to do. But rejecting this request would be really improper. If it wasn't for Lennon who's standing there, I'd definitely think my, oh, my way out. Okay, I'll come along. Nicely. That's how a true pioneer should answer. Even after those, these words, I hardly came a step closer to be prepared, always prepared model. Then, you can go. I looked at Lena, who was still staring at the ground. I guess all that time she was staring at the ground was enough to learn everything there is to know about life and habits of different insects. Plus, Lena likes to read, so she probably read many biological, bot botanical, and so on books. Science! <laughs> Science isn't even real! <laughs> like, you know, cells. Like, we're made up of cells, really. It's really science. <laughs> That's just a big lie. <laughs> That's that's one of my go-to jokes to make people angry. <laughs> just be. 
Perhaps she wanted to become an entomologist? I don't even know what that is. That is bad. Where will you head next? Not this word just threw me away from my obscure thoughts. Well, it's been standing at the square for some time, and my speculations about Bugs Life's will it's only a tap to escape this awkward situation. Go watch the movie by Pixar! Or is it Disney? Well, they're the same thing. Though, so why did I see it awkward? Just do not forget, alright? Do not forget what? Well, tonight after dinner, at the infirmary. I'm gonna forget. <laughs> your face got a slightly grumpy feel to it. No worry, that's impossible. Alright, alright, after dinner, I'm at your service. I'd be thought to... Is be thought a word, or is that just... Be... Be think. Okay, so be thought's a word. Wow, it actually is. After my words, Leonard blushed harder. I need to find the way to ease the situation. What did the nurse ask you to do it? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I was just sitting at the bench reading a book when she came in. Smart Jessica fell safe for a second. Who would never see it <laughs> You know, that's actually true. Okay. Well, then after dinner. Okay. I'll go. Yes, sure. Oh yeah, I forgot my little voice. Oh well. Oh well. She walked off somewhere inside the clubs and just stood at the square for some time. So, what's next? I decided to visit my cabin in order to collect my phone. I have a phone. Don't know where I'll find myself today, but having a watch is always useful. Though, having a wristwatch is much easier. I suddenly heard a different tune. Because, I mean, this is what, like, the... This is supposedly the 90s, right? So why do I have a phone? I hear a different tune, which is coming through the usual noise of this camp. Listen to it, scared for the <gasps> ice cream truck. Oh, is that what this is? An, ele an electric guitar. Three repeating chords, no more. I have my volume down, but here I'll turn it up for a second. It stopped. Oh. Okay. Uh, but this melody was somehow warmer, as if vacuum tube space audio amplifier was used. Uh, I don't even. Is that. Could there be such luxury here? Definitely the sound was coming somewhere from the stage area. I wonder who could that be? Who? <laughs> that could be anyone! I mean, it's. Anyone here plays music. Everyone. Um. I should go take a look. Who cares? I better keep on looking for the answers. I'll go take a look. I kind of said a little list on the stage. Nope, I'm out. Uh, uh, it, w it won't let me leave. Oh, okay, okay. Who cares? I better keep on looking for answers. <laughs> you know, it's a list. <laughs> I came back to the leader's cabin. All goes the lying lazily on her bed and reading a book. Samian, what are you doing here? That's what I should ask you too. I forgot in something. So until I came back. You were absent at the lineup. Yeah, we talked about this. Oh yeah, I apologize. Alright. Nevertheless, you should do something useful today. Just as I planned. But I have my own vision on what useful means. Like? You can go to the square to help with cleaning. Stop guys and judge there. Strange, I've been there and I haven't seen anyone. Or you can visit the boys club of electronics. They ask me for a hand. Those fathers of inventions again. No, I don't want to go there. Finally, you could help at the sports club. What are they up to? They're renewing the pitch, fixing the benches, changing the goals, and so on. Honestly, none of those options suit me. Why is she always such a burden? Why does she always have to burden me with work? Seriously, except for, except Slavia, no one here. No one here ever works. While some particular pe people are enjoying their free time with youth youthful spirit. <laughs> Yoihara! <laughs> Asa! <laughs> um, who well, else? Miku! <laughs> well, it's Miku, I don't actually know. Every leader's attempt to make busy seems to be following the only purpose. Prevent me from finding out my current location. Now <laughs> where am I? <laughs> really, really all, all deep and vital questions concerning my existence are swept away by a broom, together with all rubbish and litter. In my case, taking some time to work will probably pay off. But same with someone suffering gen, 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 I, what is that? Uh, is a potentially life-threatening condition that arises when a considerable mass of body tissue dies. Okay, gangre gangrene? Yeah, I think that's I'm rejecting the amputation. I will stand by my beliefs. You know, I already have my own arrangement. Oh, really? What kind of arrangement? Um, um, I have to go, um... She backed up. Well, 
I can't just tell her what I'm really thinking about, on the other hand, or not. It's too, but it's too dangerous. At least, now I keep a fra fragile balance and nothing is threatening me. Everything seems that way. Wait, what was I planning to do? Just as a thought. What exactly she thought remained a secret. You probably have not realized yet how important it is to participate in social life. This is the only way to become a role model pioneer. I don't want to be a pioneer. I don't want to attend another long lecture, so I decided to accept one of the offers. Sometimes the answers in the world are findable in the most unexpected places. At least, I want to believe so. So, should I choose for you? The leader's voice was turned authoritative. That, her face is weird. Like, it's usually like, uh, you know, like weird, but now it's like, it's better now, but so weird. I can do it myself, thank you. Mumbled, I into the beard. Mumbled I into the beard. <laughs> Mumbled I into the beard, then went out of the cabin. I'd rather help sloppy. I think I'll oh, just I'll help the sports club. Stop yeah. After two evils, well, three in this case, choose the lesser, they say. Fabio wasn't evil at all, so my choice was obvious. Any rational being keeps his house clean, but I usually perceived house cleaning as something similar to gym workouts. Yeah, it's a good thing, but not my thing at all. However, I like the idea of painting the benches or of helping- Wait, who, who's in the sports club? I'm assuming Oyama and Alyssa? Or- I like the idea of painting the benches uh, or of helping two future geniuses of Russian or Soviet science even less. Wait, so- it, was the Soviet Union actually not called Russia? I, I don't actually know. Um, was the Soviet Union called Russia? I don't actually know. Um, like, I know, I technically, they're, they're like the same thing. Like, I, I, I know that much, but I could, could you call the Soviet Union Russia and still be correct? I don't know. No, I'm not, I'm not Russian. I don't know. I'm from America. All they teach is American. There are about a dozen pioneers in the square. Um, where did they all come from, I wonder? I approached Slavia. Hey there. Oh, hi. You've come to help? Well, not out of my free will, of course. I thought it over again. I see. Take it the broom. Your area is right next to the monument. Frankly speaking, there's nothing to broom there. It seemed pretty clean to me. Though some rubbish was still laying around. Da, da, da. After brooming for a while, I came back to Slavia, who's sitting on the bench taking a break. Uh, what a nice day. Yeah, but it's a bit too hot. She covered her eyes with her hand and looked up at the sky. You look a tireless worker of communist labor. Ah, uh, come on. I just like to help others. That's good. What about you? What about me? Seems like you're a bit burdened by the community service? No. Yes. Well, probably. Why is that? I don't really know. Seriously, she can't expect me to just throw all my ideas containing the point at her. She might drown in them, God forbid. <laughs> Maybe you just don't like company? It's actually quite possible. There's some true. There's something true. Oh, okay. I thought it was, there was some true. <laughs> it's obvious words. I suppose that she was good at reading other people's minds. At least, reading mine. Though, how can it be possible if I find it hard to understand myself at times? What are you going to do when the session's over? Session? I talked about. What do you mean? Or you're going to enter college? Or want to perform a profession? In USSR, a person finishing high school typically had to go to college between either getting a college degree, typically achieving a status of engineer or scientist, or going into secondary vocational school that's mastering a profession. I'd already achieved my achieved grand mastery at all my professions. Watching anime and surfing the internet. <laughs> you know, I've actually um, achieved um, grand mastery at both of those too. That was good. I don't know yet. What about you? We have a small farm back home, so I want to help my parents there. It's been pretty strange. Are there any private farms in the USSR? Where are all the farming has to be collective? But I've decided not to go into the details. So what are your parents doing? Your parents are not a good thing to 
to this guest. It's not that my parents are not good. Quite the opposite. They're kind hearted people. But it's not the right time for such a discussion. My father works at a local council. My mother is a teacher. That was an extra truth. More like half the truth. Cool. She seemed to be <laughs> cool. She seemed to really consider that a cool thing. I guess so. The dialogue had reached the dead end, so I'd try to take my ways away from Slavia. But I kept gazing under my feet, up in the sky and looking around. You know, I'm pretty sure you're... No, um, wait, what? Pretty sure you'll also be fine. Slavia looked at me thoughtfully. Now what was that for? And what was this also about? Th th thanks, I mumbled. But what do you mean? It's supposed that you happen to be too pessimistic at times. Isn't that um, way too um, um, straightforward? Yeah, um, maybe? But you're gonna be alright, maybe. After this conversation, I felt a little at ease. On the other hand, there's nothing special in their words. In general, almost every person being in Slavia's shoes would come to similar conclusions. Nevertheless, I felt, but not for the first time, that she could see right through me. So, let's get to cleaning. Aha! She smiled and took the room. I never thought the cleaning would bring such deep pleasure. No, I was upset because, because of this conversation. No, I wasn't upset because of this conversation. On the contrary, I was glad to hear that from her. For the first time ever, somebody was discussing my life without criticizing me, without giving me any stupid advice based on his own personal experience, without intentions to go through my head and without making some far-reaching conclusions. I was just glad that somebody supported me. No, it's not quite right. It's not quite right. I was glad that it was Slavia who supported me. Wait, no, no. Uh, I'm glad it's Lena that's supporting me. In a short while, the music that was playing around the camp called, calling for lunch, I put away in the room with a sigh of relief, a sense of accomplishment, and went to the canteen. Yay! I think I'll call it there, guys. Um, That's episode 11. Um, I don't know if that was the right choice to go with Slavia or not, but hopefully... Hopefully it was, and I'll see you guys next time. See ya.